Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a book review. Hey, today we're going to look at 202 Methods of Forcing from Theo Anneman. Uh, what this is, it's exactly like it sounds. It's a book on card forcing, okay? And 202. Uh, 202 different methods. Uh, Theo Anneman, if you don't know, is a mastermind of magic. has been around for a long time. Most of the classic books uh, contain at least one or two of his tricks. Uh, this book you can find currently on Amazon or from your favorite magic retailer. As you can see, the book is really a booklet. <laughs> it's very much a pamphlet. And so I think it's easily around the $6 range. It's, it's under $10. It's a very affordable book. All right, so why should you have this book in your library? Well, for one, it's a classic of magic. Number two, it's Theo Anneman. Uh, number three, a lot of other books refer to it, or a lot of videos refer to it, they'll say, as you see in 202 Methods of Forcing. Um, so that would be a, a big reason. Another reason would be just to, as a resource to go to and draw inspiration from. Sometimes uh, when you're putting a trick together, creating your own trick, or you're doing multiple tricks back to back, you don't want to do the same force over and over again on the same spectator because they'll start to catch why. It's like, why do you keep doing that same force? Like maybe you want to mix it up and show that you know more than just the riffle force, right? So getting this as a resource, 202 methods of forcing, uh, would help you with that. Now, that said, you have to understand that with 202 methods of forcing, they're not all winners, okay? Far from it. They're not all go-tos. They're not all the best. This is more like a, a compendium of, of, of a ton, and you have to kind of weed through them to find the good ones, okay? They're not listed as best to worst, they're just listed. And so you have to do a lot of reading uh, to find those good ones. And so if reading isn't your thing, if you don't like books, eh, maybe you might not like this. The other uh, negative or the other downside to this is this has not been rewritten in 2016 vocabulary, okay? This, if it, this is gonna read a lot like Shakespeare <laughs> or uh, the King James Bible, okay? And that doesn't mean that there's these and thous and the King's English in this, okay? But it's definitely a more archaic form of writing. And so you just kind of have to get past that to get into the heart of it. And so when I sit down to read this, I don't read it, I kind of scred it, I kind of read fast and see if this is something I want to look at. And if I don't like that force, I just go on to the next one, you know? Some of these forces are really outside the box, like stick all the cards in a paper bag and shake them up. Like they're, they're like that, okay? So they're not all just straightforward fanning or spreading or riffling down the deck. Uh, some of these are very, very, very creative. Some of them are very, very outside the box. And so again, you'll have to go through it, glean from it, see which one of these uh, fits your style the best and, and go from there. Opening page in this book is from 1932, okay? So you can just guess that the language is that old, okay? There's also, there's also not any pictures, okay? The book's pretty much gonna look just like this, where every single force is written out in one of these little uh, chapter headings. So it's gonna rely on you either doing the force with the book as you're going through it or just picturing it, what it looks like in your head. All right, so that is my review for 202 Methods of Forcing from Theo Anneman, a classic of card magic and definitely should be on your shelf if you are into card magic, at least card tricks. As always, we recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy, and you can always catch up with more content at magic orthodoxy.com. Thanks. Bye.